up everybody, Deuce with Deuce Gaming here, and welcome to back to Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. Now we're going to get into the GX series, and I know I said I wouldn't do this one for a long time, but for some reason my capture card isn't capturing really any other games, and it's really frustrating, but I want to get content out to you guys, so I'm going to be recording Yu-Gi-Oh! GX. And this is my all-time favorite series. Um, really quick, I will not be giving Jaden Yu-Gi or really any characters any real voices until I can figure some out. Because his first duel is against Dr. Crowler, and he has like this really high-pitched, weird voice. So I'll, if I if I if I'm feeling a groove, I'll throw it in there. But you know, for now, let's just get into it. I will be using one of my own decks. That's an Elemental Hero deck, which is my second favorite deck of all time. Uh, spellcasters are number one, but E Heroes are a close second. Um, and if I try to use the so somebody playing as a normal duel. And not the tutorial, which it will be explaining fusions and all that crap. Um, I will not be doing that uh, for using that because it's not an actual elemental hero deck. I actually had to re-record this knowing that. So, alright, so let's get into it. Thanks to Yugi and his friends, dueling had now become a worldwide phenomenon. And duel academies popped up everywhere. Aspiring duelist Jaden Yugi was given the chance to enter the highly distinguished duel academy. But there was one catch. He must win a duel to gain entry. In his rush to get to school, he bumped into a mysterious person that resembled a familiar figure from the past. Ah, sorry. You're a duelist, aren't you? Yep, I'm gonna try out. I'm going to try out at the academy. God damn. You don't say. Yeah. Wait. Hey, you're. Why don't you take this? Something just tells me that it belongs with you. Wow, for real? Good luck. Realizing that he was late, Jaden rushed off to the, to the academy, hoping to get there in time to qualify for entry. Alright, test time! Son, what's your name? Uh, Jaden Yuki. Well, uh, Jaden Yuki, I'm Dr. Velian Crowler, Department Chair of Techniques here at Duel Academy. Wow, a department- god damn. Wow, a department chair? I had no idea. From how you were dressed, I was thinking you were some kind of weird academy mascot, like a majorette or a cheerleader. How do I get one of those cool dual blazers like the one you're wearing? A lot of hard work and extreme high marks. Well, I'm ready, so let's duel. Alright, so I will be using a user deck. And it's my ear, I called it the ear e hero starter. You guys have probably seen it in my other videos. If you guys are coming back, what's up? And if you guys are new, what's up? So, Jaden uses Elemental Heroes, and I did specifically design this deck to be about maybe 75 cannon correct uh, during its first duel. Alrighty then. So, we're going to summon Elemental Hero for Stintrix. We're going to set Hero Blast face down, and we are going to end our turn. Alright, so he's gonna set. I'm guessing that's gonna be Ancient Gearbox. That's a lot of face downs. I'm scared, guys. Alright, so we got Rottweiler now in our hand. We're not gonna summon him. We're just going. I'm guessing that this is Gearbox. Yeah, so I just lost 800 life points. Oh wow, I feel like I got a burp. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry about that, guys. I don't know why, but I've been really gassy lately. Like, burping wise. Alright, he ends his turn. I'm going to draw. Alright, so we're going to activate this card's effect. Captain Gold, send that to the graveyard to get Skyscraper. Alright, and then we're going to activate Skyscraper. We're going to activate the Warrior Returning Alive so we can get Captain Gold back to our hand. Alright, and then we're going to uh, summon... Elemental Hero Captain Gold into attack mode because he can only be on the field when Skyscraper is on the field. All right, so we're gonna have her destroy. Okay, he was it was supposed to gain a thousand, but you know, oh well. All right, so Fiendish Chain negated that, and for some reason I don't know why. Uh, oh, the attack of the attack. Oh, okay, my bad. I'm an idiot. I thought of raise it even if the defense was higher. Just just ignore me, guys. Alright, so we got Elemental Hero Heat in attack mode. He gains a crap ton of attack points, so we're going to have him attack 
his gearbox, and another freaking fiendish chain, really? Oh, we're gonna end our turn because we can't do swap. Alright. I'm just gonna set another monster face down. And his turn, I'm gonna draw. Alright, so this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna summon Elemental Hero Avion. Activate Miracle Fusion. We're going to summon our Flame Wingman by using Avion and Burstinatrix on our field. It's going to remove it from play, but you know what? That's okay. And the cool thing about Flame Wingman is when he destroys a monster, he inflicts damage to the monster's attack points to the owner's life points. So he just lost 500 because that monster's attack points was 500. Now, the other one is called uh, Phoenix Enforcer, I think, and he's a badass too. He can't be destroyed by battle. Which, I'm um, hopefully, I can summon him eventually. Alright, so I'm going to draw my card. It's Elemental Hero Sparkman. That's actually really cool. So we're going to summon Sparkman into attack mode. Alright, so this is what we're going to do. We're going to have Flame Wing Man attack that bad boy. Ancient Gear, he loses 100 life points. Have Sparkman attack his other face down, Ancient Gear. We're going to end our turn. Alright, so hopefully he's not going to use that thing to summon Ancient Gear Golem, because right now we are honestly not ready for him. So we just lost 500 life points, Fiendish Chain is now gone, and it's our draw. Cool, so we're going to activate Parallel World Fusion. This allows us to summon Phoenix Enforcer into attack mode by fusing from our Remove From Play section, and it puts it in the deck, shuffles the deck, and then we get to summon him. So we're going to summon Elemental Hero Phoenix Enforcer into attack mode, who cannot be destroyed by battle. Alright, and if we draw Polymerization, we can actually upgrade these guys. So first, what we're going to do is we're going to have him attack that. Uh, why didn't his attack points increase? Is they're equal or higher? It's supposed to give it a bonus. But you know what? Oh well. Phoenix, Enfor Phoenix Enforcer is okay, because if he does summon Ancient Gear Golem, he cannot destroy our Phoenix Enforcer. So we're good on that one. So he's going to activate Fiend Sanctuary, summon that, and if we try to destroy that, we are basically screwed up the pooch. Alright, so I'm going to draw, and it's another Avion, so what we're going to actually do is we're going to summon Rottweiler into attack mode. Um, I would use uh, Winged Karibo, but you know what? It's not really worth it, because we're going to lose life points because of this to try to get rid of that. Then we are going to have Sparkman attack the face down, which is Ancient Gear Cannon. And then we're going to have Phoenix Enforcer attack him directly to make him lose 2,100 life points, and we're going to end our turn. Now, I bet he's really pining for a damn freaking Ancient Gear Golem right now, but it looks like he's not drawing it. And that's another one of those. Anyways, I draw my card. It's a Burstinatrix. We're going golden, guys. Alright, so we're going to go into attack mode. We're not going to summon anything for it just in case. But just in case, we're going to have this. Oh, we just lost 400 life points, so we're going to have to go in with that, destroy that. We're going to have Rottweiler attack him directly. So he loses 800. He only has 800 life points left, and we're going to end our turn. All right, so he draws, and he sets a monster face down. He gets another damn gear token or ancient token or ancient gear token. I don't know. We're going to set that face down. We're going to switch Rottweiler to defense mode. We're going to switch Captain Gold to defense mode, just in case, because you can't do squat. Alright, so we're going to get rid of that. That's Ancient Gear Cannon. We're going to attack directly and end this duel with Elemental Hero Phoenix Enforcer. Now, I know that's not exactly how but it is what it is. And that's game! So I guess I passed the test, huh, Teach? Impossible! There's no way a delinquent could defeat me! I made it to the Academy! I'm in! I'm in! By defeating Dr. Crowler, Jaden was granted entry to Duel Academy. The next day, everyone gathered in the main hall for the introduction ceremony. Welcome, my students! I am Chancellor Shepard, the headmaster here. You are the best and the brightest young duelist in the world! Now please get yourselves settled in your assigned dorms. I think you'll find them quite comfortable, depending on how you are ranked. Of course. Well, I don't know, I don't know about you, Cy, but it looks like I'm in Slifer Red Dorm. 
That's cool! Same with me! I just made him sound like Mario. Sorry, guys. Hey, Bastion, you in red, too? Well, now, let's see here. Yellow sleeves, yellow buttons. I don't think so. Oh, I guess. I get it. So that's why Sai and I are in red. Well, don't tell me that you just figured that out now. So what? Ever think I'm colorblind? Well, no, actually, I didn't. Are you colorblind? No, but I could have been. See you around the dorms. I doubt that. You're going the wrong way. Your dorm is over there. This is our dorm? It's like an outhouse with a deck. You, you kidding me? Check out the view. This place is great. This is this one here is our room, Sai. It's kind of small, huh? Hey, you're a small guy. Anyway, I like it. This will make a sweet pad for her first year here. It's kind of weird meeting at the entrance exams, and now roommates? Think we're somehow connected to each other like in some ancient life, Jaden? You know, like you were an ancient Egyptian pharaoh and I was like your guardian Seto? No offense, but that's just lame. Well, it could be true. Forget it. They broke the molds when they made the two of us. Yeah, for some reasons. But you're an awesome duelist and I'm... What's the opposite of awesome? An awesome? Sai, we're gonna... We're gonna have to work on that confidence, but first, let's work on this pad. Open the curtains and let the fresh air in. Hey, those were closed for a reason. Oh, sorry. Yeah, we didn't see you sleeping up there on the bunk bed. Who are you, and what do you think you're doing in my room? Oh, sorry, my name's Jaden Yuki. And I'm Cyrus. We're your new roommates. You're, you're new, all right, so let me tell you how things work around here. I know Chumley is kind of gruff and kind of dorkish, but I can't really do that voice. So sorry, guys, they're going to have a weird-ass voice for Chumley. What things? Like when Parents Weekend is going to be? More like how the whole color thing works. That's more important than anything. Yeah? You've got three different kinds of students here. Obelisk Blue students, Raw Yellow students, and Slifer Red students. The Blues are the highest ranked students. Some kids are blue because of grades, others through connections. The Yellows are second highest, mostly younger students and lots of potential. Then there's us, the Red Wonders. The Wonders? That's a cool name. As in, I wonder how flunkies like us ever got this far. Sorry, but we're at the bottom of the barrel here, dueling duds. Hello, children. My name is Professor Vanna. I am the only... I am not only a headmaster at Slifer Red, but I also teach alchemy at Duel Academy. Why alchemy would be important at a dueling school, I have no idea, guys. You will also learn that I'm a wonderful chef. Why, all my students characterize my scrumptious meals as adequate. So chop chop to the cafeteria, it's lunchtime. Oh, I'm Chumley, by the way. Alright, so that's that, we got duel points, cool. The next one's a duel in love. Now, next one, I probably will try my best to do a female voice, so don't judge too harshly. Anyways, guys, um, I will try, maybe use the story mode deck for that one, but I really like the Elemental Hero deck I just recently built. Um, I'll just I'll just focus on that one, because it has essentially all the same cards, except for the Heat and Lady Heat and cards and like that. I just, just stuff I threw into the mold for right now. <clears throat> Excuse me. Anyways, I'll see you guys next time. I'm Deuce with Deuce Gaming. Please like and subscribe down below and comment down below for any games you'd like to see. I am trying to fix my game capture card and I am sorry. I'll see you guys next time.